Greetings, I am an s -Drag, and we're going to edit the graphics in The Legend of Zelda for the NES with this program. So, it's a little bit tricky, I have actually loaded up two versions of this program, just so you can see the original ROM, Legend of Zelda, and uh, here's my edited version. So, when you load it up, you have to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... Here it starts happening things, and then you have to be on this pattern and push this little minus. So, now you can actually see Link and we can edit his eyes to anything you want. This is just a matter of creativity. No face Link, how about that? Uh, so, let's have a look at my edited version. Minus and 16. Here's Mario. So never mind these colors. There are going to be different colors in in the game. That's another thing. So you don't have to worry about this. I, I usually like I go over to this one because it's closest to what it looks like in the game. And you can right click on this and make it some other color if you want. Perhaps black. Or right click. Okay. Now it looks pretty good actually. And uh, we can do the same thing here. Like that. And they code this in a rather peculiar way because you have to go up three here's push the minus to see this is actually some of the of the on the, the screen in the intro and we have also the sword right here but it looks a little bit odd so we have to just jumble this around until it looks like the actual sword here it is and here's the wand as well you can look at my edited version oh, I never there you go it's minus and then one block down so I have edited in the hammer from Super Mario Brothers 1 the wand I haven't changed yet and the arrow is actually going to be a fireball in this version I'm working on but you can do anything you want this is very important when he went link or Mario in my version is lifting something up like the raft this is the animation you will go to and this is the large shield animation uh, I don't know why it's up here but it is uh, this is also a merchant I don't think he's actually used or he's perhaps later in the game I haven't seen this sprite you can edit it uh, here's some enemies as well I don't know why this guy is up here but I do know that there are a lot of enemies and graphics down here you just have to like try trial and error to get this to work perhaps there's another a better way of doing this but this is how I do it there we go and we have a pulse voice we can edit out the whiskers if we want to I don't know why do you, you would want that here's the end of the graphics here's Ganon and we can look how he looks in my version one block down okay here we go naturally he's Bowser in this Mario version oh and one other thing the shield animation is just one frame so the this part of Link is always going to look like this when he is having the large shield that's why Mario also have a shield here it's a power shield, I guess. 
Uh, there's nothing I can do about that right now because this is locked. This is how he's going to look when he grabs the big shield. So the left side is completely numb, <laughs> if that makes any sense. So be careful with that. Also, you can edit like smaller fragments if you choose or bigger this is like good if you want to just copy something smaller perhaps i just want part of mario's head control c and then control v there we go Easy peasy. Okay, thanks for watching.